One time a guy handed me a picture of me. He said, here's a picture of me when I was younger. Every picture is of you when you were younger. <laughs> ain't, that, ain't, that, ain't that about time someone said that? I think Pringles' initial intention was to make tennis balls. <laughs> but on the day that the rubber was supposed to show up, a big truckload of potatoes arrived. <laughs> and Pringles said, what the hell? Cut them up. <laughs> I think a rotisserie is like a really morbid Ferris wheel for chickens. <laughs> it's a very scary piece of machinery. We will take the chicken, impale it, and then rotate it. And I'll be damned if I'm not hungry. Because spinning chicken carcasses make my mouth water. If you go to the grocery store and you stand in front of the lunch meat section for too long, you start to get pissed off at turkeys. You see like turkey ham, turkey pastrami, turkey bologna. Someone needs to tell the turkeys, man, just be yourself. I already like you, little brother. You do not need to emulate the other animals. You got your own thing going. I had an apartment in Los Angeles, and I had a neighbor. And whenever he would knock on my wall, I knew he wanted me to turn my music down, and that made me angry, because I like loud music. So when he knocked on the wall, I'd mess with his head. I'd say, go around. I cannot open the wall. I don't know if you have a doorknob on the other side, but over here, there's nothing. <laughs> I like Kit Kats unless I'm with four or more people. When I wear T-shirts, I can only wear V-necks because my neck is very fragile. I cannot wear a regular neck shirt. It hurts. <laughs> and I especially hate turtlenecks. Like, wearing a turtleneck is like being strangled by a really weak guy. <laughs> All damn day. Like, if you wear a turtleneck and a backpack, it's like a weak midget trying to bring you down. <laughs>